going on guys welcome back to my channel my name is Daniel Huckins and today we've got a really cool card trick to show you this is a two card Monty and it was performed by David Blaine on his uh, magic street magic special so credits to him I don't know if he created it or not but um, I'm giving credit to him right now because he was one of the first people that like kind of introduced it more on a street magic level so credits to him and that's all I gotta say, so let's get into the tutorial. Okay, for this trick, I'll be using the Bicycle Vintage Rider Back playing cards. These are not the ones from Illusionist, but um, if you want to check them out, link in description. Okay, so what you'll need to do this, you'll need two cards. I like to use face cards, kind of that are similar like that, and then you'll need a pair of two other cards. I usually use the aces. If I'm using red face cards then I'll use black aces. If I'm using red aces I'll use black face cards. But it doesn't matter what you use. Just try and make them a contrast in a pair. So what the setup is, is on top of the deck you'll put, I'm just gonna refer to it as if you're using aces and jacks, okay? So you put one black ace on the top a red jack, and then a red jack, and then another ace. So it should look like this. Pretty easy. Okay, so first you get a quadruple lift. That's right. But you're going to use it as a triple. You're just going to get a break under the top four cards that you have prepared right there. Okay, get that break. And then I introduced this as a two card Monty and you gotta find these two cards and I like to refer to them as clubs and spades depending on what I'm using so this is just clubs and put that in their hand and they have to find it so then I take this one and I say this is if that's just clubs what is this they'll say spades well they usually will and I put this down they don't know it's already switched for a jack because I lift it up three cards okay so when you put this one down you're just holding a break above these three so you put that down and they think that spades into this is clubs now you say I'm gonna take clubs you can show them this so it's it's more believable that they have spades in their hands and you say I'm gonna switch it really quickly it's gonna look like this and you do that and they're holding it like this right so you do that so it's believable that you may have switched it but at the same time, it's not. Okay? Now, then, you say, do you think I switched or not? So do you think I have clubs, and you have spades, or I have spades, and you have clubs? And while saying this, you're going to do a move called the top change. Okay? It looks like this. And it's really easy. And when you're talking to them, you want to look, look them in the eye so they look up. And you can do this really quickly. And nobody notices. Okay? So you didn't actually switch it. You just did that motion, and then I usually turn the deck like that, so it's just quick switch, and I ask them while I'm saying this and looking up at them, I say, so what do you think I have? Do you think I have spades and you have clubs? Well, I have clubs and you have spades. And they'll usually think that you didn't switch it, so the last card you showed was clubs. So they'll say, oh, I have spades. But it doesn't matter now, because the two cards are switched. So they're not expecting that. They're expecting maybe they're wrong and the, and you actually switch their card. But then once you flip that over, bam. They don't even expect it. That's how mind-blowing it is. I've gotten some good reactions from this. It's a pretty cool trick. The only problem I've had is the top change. I've worked on that, though. So I hope you enjoyed this trick. And that is all for the tutorial. Thank you guys so much for watching this. I do hope you enjoyed it. I appreciate you watching this. If you're new here and you like this content that I'm bringing, please subscribe, hit that button below, and don't forget the bell so that you can be notified the very second I upload. And if you did like this video, enjoy it, and got something out of it, hit that like button, because that helps too. If you want the cards the, that I used in this tutorial, the link will be in the description. And thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you on the next video. See ya.